presidential elections just four months away and this morning we're learning vice president kamala harris is expected to make a return trip here to north carolina this week she's scheduled for a campaign event in greensboro thursday no other specific details available at this time pressure although also mounting for president biden as a growing number of democrats call on him to drop out of the race it comes during a crucial week as the president welcomes over 30 world leaders for the nato summit wcnc charles Bree jackson has the latest from washington Good morning, Ben. According to a letter from a White House doctor, President Biden had a physical in February and showed no signs of any neurological disorder, including Parkinson's disease. <laughs> President Biden in a fierce fight for his political future. But if any of these guys yeah. don't think I should let them run against me, go ahead, announce the announce president. Challenge me at the convention. Meanwhile, White House officials are facing questions about the 81-year-old's health following reports that a Parkinson's expert visited the White House at least eight times in an eight-month period, according to public visitor logs, leading to this testy exchange between the press secretary and reporters. Share names no, 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 in regards no, no. to if we, someone came here no, in regards we to cannot the share, We cannot share names of specialists broadly. It, from a dermatologist to a neurologist. A White House physician later releasing this statement explaining Dr. Kevin Kennard's visits, writing that he is a neurological specialist who examined President Biden for each of his annual physicals. Some Democrats call concerns about the president's health a distraction and are calling on him to drop out of the presidential race. Personally, I think Kamala Harris would be a much better, stronger candidate. I made clear publicly the day after the debate that I support President Joe Biden in the Democratic ticket. My position has not changed. Former President Trump is also weighing in. Well, we prepared for him, but I don't think it's going to matter. We have we had a great four years. President Biden facing a pivotal test, hosting world Can't leaders for a NATO summit in Washington while under scrutiny about his health. President Biden and his health will be under a microscope as he takes part in NATO events here in Washington, D.C. over the next three days and holds a news conference Thursday. In Washington, Bree Jackson, WCNC Charlotte.